In this course, I'm going to be using Visual Studio Code in order to run our uh, Python scripts. And in order to run uh, Python scripts in uh, Visual Studio Code, you need to download and install a, um, an extension. If you click here on the extensions and then search for Python, you'll find many, many extensions. And the best extension is this one, the extension that is provided by Microsoft. As you can see, this one. Click on it and then you need to install it. Just click here on install and since I have already installed it here it's gonna say uninstall because I have already installed it. And once you install it what you need to do is that you need to um, learn how to run your uh, Python scripts with this extension. So suppose that let me close this and let me show you how you can run a Python script Suppose that we have a Python script. Let me create here a Python uh, file. And then I'm going to create here a new file. I'm going to click on File and then New File. And then it's going to be uh, just Text Editor. And then I'm going to save it as... I'm going to save it on my desktop. And I'm going to save it as uh, test.py. This is very important. You need to add the extension py. And I'm going to save it on my desktop. And then I'm going to click on Save. And now what I'm going to do is that I'm going to open it and as you can see it will automatically be opened and I'm going to just type a simple uh, Python script here just print print the uh, print and then um, here I'm going to say this is Python and then I'm going to save I'm going to save click here file and then save and by the way you can uh, install also Py, uh, PyLint if you wish you can click on install it's better to install it if you wish click uh, on install and it will be installed for you and now once you are done once you just created this very very simple Python script just right click and then click on run Python file in terminal click on it and it will execute this file and as you can see here it says this is Python so it um, it was executed successfully and you can also click here on run and then start debugging or even run without debugging and it will also execute your code and if you wish for some reason if you wish to if you wish to um, remove this extension you just need to click on uh, the extensions uh, icon and then here search for Python and then click on it again this extension which is installed click on it and then you can uninstall it or even uh, disable it. And again, you can download uh, PyLint. You can click here on install and it will start uh, installing.